He's a G though. He's done so much for the sport. Does this mic work? Well then, fuck that mic! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> On the count of three, three, I want everyone in this arena to scream at the top of your lungs. Fuck the Mayweather's! He don't give a fuck. One, two, three! <laughs> Mayweather went from straight face to cracking up. No, 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 no. <laughs> we can do better than that. When I can't. He just spat his gum out. Did he land on someone? <laughs> he <don't care. laughs> He owns the stage right now. Oh my god, yeah. The tree. I want this entire arena. Can Mayweather to scream. Oh my god. Fuck the Mayweathers. One, two, Tree, fuck the Mayweather's. He's there cracking up. He got everyone saying it though. Yeah. It's a big audience saying that. He won't do shit. <laughs> do fucking nothing. And while we're at it, fuck Showtime too. You little weasel. Look at you, you little fucking weasel. Like a sin <laughs> in your eyes. You're a fucking bitch. <laughs> Cut my mic off! Cut the champ champ's mic off! Hell no! You fucking weasel and you fucking bitch! Straight in their face, he does not give a fuck. That's why everyone loves McGregor. He, he is entertainment. Care. He's entertainment to us. Literally. Fullest. And that's why this sold so many tickets. Yeah. It's such a hype. They're trying to set me up at every turn out here. They're trying to catch me off guard. Trying to see me in an uncomfortable position. But I thrive in uncomfortable positions. This suit is not There is no. nothing these can do to phase me. 28 years of age. I'm getting fight checks and promoter checks. There's only 28 here. When Floyd was 28, he was on Oscar De La Hoya's undercard. Ah. Uh, and that's just facts. <laughs> he's saying he's a side man. What's up, Toronto? <laughs> What's up, Ireland? The Irish fans, they will, wherever McGregor is, they're going. They follow They will him. travel across the world for it. Literally. Floyd is an old, weak bitch. Sing it to me. I want you to sing it to me. And I want you to dance for me. You sing it, you dance. Dance for me, boy! <laughs> He's dancing, so. <laughs> I'm not fucking leaving! That's Wolf of Wall Street. Remember the scene where he's like, I'm not fucking leaving! Oh, Everyone yeah. goes ballistic. <laughs> That's literally it. He's been wanting to do that for a while, you could tell. 50 strippers on his payroll, this man has. What the fuck is he doing with that strip club? He actually owns a strip club. What the fuck? 50 stripper bitches on his payroll. <laughs> Shout out to all the stripper bitches on his payroll. It's worth it, Even Dana White is cracking up. At least Rob Kardashian only had one. He has 50. <laughs> I'm not getting off this mic. I want him to come and take this mic off me. Otherwise, I'm taking over this whole shit. Of course, I'm watching a com uh, comedy stand-up. This is literally just straight up. It's a grilling session. Yeah. Who can grill each other harder? It's right here. It's right here. Stop me. <laughs> you won't do shit. <laughs> Toronto. Toronto, what a fucking city. What a city. What a city. I was here two, uh, the last, I was here one time, two years ago, three years ago. 
tree. I was also on a world tour. I was also facing an unconquerable quest. I was facing the then pound for pound number one fighter on the planet, Jose Aldo. Big fight. They said the same things then as they're saying now. They said I had no chance. They said I'm in over my head. They said he kicks too hard. <laughs> too many weapons. The Irish man's gonna fall short, he doesn't stand the hope. It took me 13 seconds. Knocked him out. I just want to speak to all the boxing pussies, all the little thunder <laughs> pussies, supposed experts. You're fucking crazy if you think this man stands a chance. His head is too small. <laughs> One shot is all it takes me. Check the facts. I bounce shots off there. I bounce heads off the canvas and dribble that shit. <laughs> he tip tap toes to a decision. He's never even fought a day in his life. He's a runner. He's boxing's biggest bitch. Damn. Goodness. Disrespectful as fuck. Look at Dana White. He's like, that's my boy. That's my boy. He's like <laughs> the proud like a father. Yeah, literally a proud father. He is. <laughs> um, McGregor made him all his money here, yeah. man. Shout out Drizzy Drake. Started from the bottom. Now, now we're here. here. Now we're here, bitches. <laughs> Life is so fucking good. How do I look? He looks great, I can't lie. His suit is sick. That suit is you know that's a dress. Nicely. What the fuck is he wearing? <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a little break dancer or something. A little 12 year old <laughs> break dancer, bitch. What the fuck? <laughs> He's 40. You're 40 years of age. Dress your fucking age. Carrying a school bag on stage. What are you doing with a school bag on stage? You can't even read. Ah, oh, you boy them. <laughs> 40 years old carrying a school bag. The man doesn't even fucking read. The disrespect is high. Toronto, I love you all. Thank you all so much. It's an honor for me to come here. It's a fucking honor. I love each and every one of you. Showtime executives. Just know no matter what situation you put me in, I always come out on top. Whoppa! 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 